Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Timmy Treacle. And in this video, I'm going to be reviewing the film 80 for Brady. Now, the movie was released on February 3rd, 2023. It was directed by Kyle Marvin. And it has a 5.8 out of 10 on IMDb. And a 58% on Rotten Tomatoes. Now, the movie stars Jane Fonda, Rita Marino, Sally Field, Lily Tomlin, uh, Harry Hamlin, and of course, Tom Brady. And in this movie, this is based on a true story about four best friends who want to live life to the fullest. So they embark on a trip to go see their hero and watch the Super Bowl uh, in 2017 uh, featuring Tom Brady and the Atlanta Falcons. And we all know how that turned out. <laughs> Sorry, Atlanta. Anywho, uh, I was expecting a nice road trip comedy movie. And what we got was a little bit of a disappointment. I love the four leading ladies in the movie. Uh, I like the characters. I just don't think it was that, uh, uh, that well written of a script. Uh, I wanted to see some more funny scenes, and and I, and I know the, the ladies being you know older and everything, they're limited in what they can do physically, but there's still a lot of things you can do to make a great comedy movie without being f that physical, and that's what I wanted to see in this movie, and uh, it was just a typical, uh, you know, friends, you know, having a last one last hurrah and just. Yeah, uh, it was just okay. Uh, it wasn't terrible like some people were, are saying it is, and and everything. But it's just it was just an average movie, and uh, nothing really special. Uh, so with that, I will give uh, eighty for Brady a six out of ten. Uh, no thumbs up, no thumbs down. Just a six out of ten. Definitely not the worst of the year, but I would say probably in the, the bottom third of the movie so far. With that, in the comment section below, if you've seen it, give me your thoughts and opinions. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. And if you like this video, hit that like button and share this video on your social media as you see fit to. Uh, other than that, uh, stay tuned for my next movie review, which will be the 1986 film The Wraith, starring Charlie Sheen. But thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.